I decided to write The Guardian of Secrets because of my love for Spain, first of all. I was very lucky to grow up here as a child and also because I took great interest in Spain's history. Apart from the historical aspect of it, it's very much deeply involved with the family members. I'm hoping that readers will take away an emotional journey from the book. I hope that they will learn about the Spanish Civil War, which was sandwiched uh, between the Great War and the Second World War, and forgotten in, in a lot of countries, or simply not known about. I hope that they'll also take away the fact that no matter how much evil there is in the world, if family stick together with love and loyalty, most things in life can be overcome. I had sent letters to a few publishing companies and they didn't even want to read the book. Um, I didn't even get to that stage. And I didn't want to wait forever to get this off the ground and so decided to, to take the plunge and do it myself. I chose Author House for two reasons. Uh, the first reason is that they looked very professional and they also had a fantastic backup team who looked after every aspect of the book's production. They take care of absolutely everything uh, from the very first day until the day that, that the book is actually on sale. So definitely I would recommend Author House to anyone. When I received the first copy of The Guardian of Secrets, I was a little bit overwhelmed and I was actually a little bit tearful. Two things struck me right at the onset and one was how heavy the book was um, and how big it had become from, from a computer file to an actual book with a shiny cover and it looked so professional. And I thought, you know, I did this and I was very, very proud, so it was a wonderful feeling.